Hey folks, Dr. Fawaz from The Wellness Way in Pleasanton. I sure hope you had a chance to look at previous videos talking about the history of cholesterol and, and the importance of cholesterol in the body. Today we'll dive deeper into the connection between cholesterol and hormones. All of your steroid hormones, including your sex hormones, energy handling hormones, reproductive hormones, are made from a precursor called cholesterol. If you can, think of cholesterol as a bond out of which multiple streams are going into different places. We have one stream going into stress land here, and we have one stream going into sex land here, and so forth. If you have more stress on your body, do you think more of that stream is going to go towards your uh, stress land, depleting your bond from cholesterol? And less of that is going to go towards your sex land and infertility land and so forth. Now, uh, one of the biggest, biggest misconceptions or one of the biggest side effects of cholesterol medication is lowering testosterone level in male. Now, we started using statin medication since the 80s and since then we have found a rise in low level of testosterone which leads to erectile dysfunction. Now, with that problem rising, we have another medication that's on the rising as well, and that's female, male enhancing medications. Now, one of those side effects for male enhancing medications is blindness. Now, with that is, you can actually, if you take, if you take statin to lower your cholesterol, which leads to lowering your testosterone, which leads to erectile dysfunction, now you can take this male enhancing medications to actually bring your testosterone back up, which could lead to, to blindness. Now, so you are now, you have, an, you have an erection, but you're blind. You can't see it anymore. And that's a very interesting concept, right? So if we keep driving cholesterol lower, we keep just attacking the cholesterol itself without finding the cause of the problem. Is it stress? Is it inflammation? Why is your cholesterol high? High cholesterol is a normal physiological response. It's a normal physiological response to a stressor. So we need to find out what's the stressor and how can we manage or eliminate that stressor, allowing the body to heal itself from the inside out. Folks, in the next video, we're going to be talking about cholesterol levels and what they mean. However, if you have not signed up for the class, the live event in our office, where we're going to go in detail about this idea or this concept of cholesterol, and we'll share with you one simple test, a $25 test. If you actually do it, it actually can tell you how likely you are to have a heart attack. Let me repeat that. It's a simple $25 test that will be able to tell you your likelihood to have a heart attack. Now, the class is, like I said, it's on Wednesday, May 24th, here in our office. And we only have limited spots to about 25 people because we can't have any more than that. The space is limited. Thank you, folks. Hope to see you at the class. Thank you.